Today in Illustrator, I will be showing you how to create a complicated looking but easy to execute fractured text effect. So the first thing to do is create a grid of rectangles. Grab your rectangle tool and begin dragging out vertical rectangles. Hold Alt and drag to copy a rectangle. If you want each rectangle spaced the same, feel free to use your align panel or press Command or Control D to repeat your last action. Feel free to add in skinny rectangles and fat rectangles to vary up the final result. Once you have this completed, select all of the rectangles, right click, and go to Make Compound Path. After that, go up to Edit, Copy, and then Edit, Paste in Place. Then grab the corner and rotate this group 90 degrees so that you have a lattice of rectangles. After that, we will need to add a gradient to these compound paths. Select one of your paths and click to add a gradient, and then pick two gradient colors. Lastly, make one of the colors about 40% opacity. Once you are happy with the result, select the other compound path and either create a separate gradient or drag the same one onto it. Now you can align these two sets of compound paths to create an interesting overlap of opacities. Once you have something you like, go ahead and grab your text tool. Then type out some text and scale it up. Next, go up to Type and then down to Create Outlines. After that, select everything that you have on the stage. Then right click and go to Make Clipping Mask. After that, select the clip letter and then go to Object and down to Flatten Transparencies and click OK. This will take all the transparent chunks of our grid and turn them permanently into the color chunks you see. After that, right click on your group and go to Ungroup. Then right click again and go to Release Clipping Mask. Now you can select each section of colors and drag them around, thus giving you a fragmented text effect. Feel free to use different colors, different shapes and sizes of grids, and different opacity gradients to drastically vary your results. So there you have it, now you have created a complicated looking fractured text effect in only a few minutes. So as always, if you enjoyed this Illustrator tutorial, be sure to subscribe, rate, comment, and share it with your friends.